We all come as one. And I just wanted to congratulate again once more. And let's have a fun day. And thank you so much for the musicians and everyone. It's about bringing communities together. It's about bringing intergenerational uh, groups together and different diversity. Take it away. We're still banned. But I find it really quite insulting sometimes. Uh, at the same time, I feel quite proud with it because, A, you need uh, people to identify with you. A, you need people to look up to role models. And that's fine because I think in that aspect, there are so many of my community who need that encouragement. And I think it's perfect and I, I respect that. But also what's lost at the same time is that being a mayor, Muslim, Muslim male wearing a hijab, uh, it, it disregards the fact that you have views, you have ideology, you have something to bring to the table other than the headscarf. I wasn't really getting response, though I was interested to sort of like help local people to have a better day and better future uh, and aspiration in life, um, particularly the voiceless community, be it uh, the black and the minority community or the wor white working class, nothing was being done for them. And, uh, and that's really what uh, got me hot under the color. Lots of important people said to me, maybe you should try to become a counsellor. And I'm thinking, are they kidding? <laughs> and then I decided, why not? And then I got the application, applied and put everything on. And that's when I actually realised that I have more experience than a career politician. That's when I realised actually people at grassroots know the real issues. You cannot represent everyone. And that's why we need role models. That's why we need representation of equality for all. When I came to England, um, you know, it's a different England to me today. Um, I, I never in my wildest dream thought I would be in this kind of office. I never thought in my wildest dream I would be debating about politics, about needs of people, um, um, people that were born, brought up in this country who have never had the life I've had. Uh, I mean, I came as a refugee. My life has been disturbed so many times. Uh, and somebody who's been here from kindergarten to right through university has never had problems. Um, I think it's a great achievement for me and many of the refugee community uh, and I, it's something to be proud of. There are times I walk into places and have conversations with people and, and people don't even notice my hijab. And it will reach a point that the hijab will be a thing of the past. Uh, but it shouldn't be the, 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 the one single issue that's defining you to stop you from what you're supposed to achieve in life.
You can be anyone. You can be anything in life. It's just that you need to have faith in yourself and the confidence that you, are, you can be.